Well, some Medicare Advantage participants are about to lose their in-network access to a major local health care provider this week. CHI Health and Aetna Insurance are pointing fingers at each other as they fail to reach a new contract. KETV News Watch 7's Aaron Hagerty is live with details. Aaron. Yeah, Julie, Rob, if a deal is not reached, tomorrow will be the last day that Aetna Medicare Advantage plans will cover CHI providers in network. And all Aetna commercial plans would no longer have in-network in access to CHI providers on November 27th. One man who lost his 29-year-old son in December told me today the change will, will impact his mental health care. Ed Hosier's tattoo shows off his love for his sons. I'm very proud father. All three of my boys served. Last year, his son John died after a seizure believed to be caused by a head injury suffered while serving in the Army. I went to go check on him, and I went to his place, and I had to have the fire department break down the door, and I found him deceased with the dog right next to him. I am grateful I had the 29 years with him but he's gone and all we can do is remember his good standings. He loved his country. After such a traumatic loss, Hozier said he's benefited from a counselor and psychiatrist he sees through CHI, but all the CHI providers are set to move out of network from his Aetna Medicare Advantage plan. Why should I go have to explain everything that's happened in my life to a new psychiatrist? bring those pains back. So he's chosen to pay extra to see a psychiatrist in October and avoid seeing his primary care or specialists until he can get a new plan. This is getting in the way with my mental health, yes. Because if I didn't make my appointment, there would have been a good chance that they would not refill my medicines. Both Aetna and CHI tell KETV they're still working on an agreement. Aetna says we're not able to reach an agreement because CHI Health Partners continues to demand unreasonable price increases that would raise health care costs significantly for members and plan sponsors. And CHI says they've been intently negotiating in good faith with Aetna to renew our contracts to offer fair and appropriate reimbursement rates for the care our hospitals and physicians provide. It's a blame game. And their tactics are going to hurt people. We need more counselors and mental health professionals in this nation. And, and I think the insurance companies are making it more difficult than it should be. And Ed's thankful he can afford, afford to pay extra, but says that won't be the case for many. He wishes this was happening on January 1st, so he could have enrolled in a new Medicare plan. Plus, he lives in northwest Omaha near CHI Emanuel. In an emergency, he's afraid he'll be stuck with a big bill. Back to you.